China's economic and political entanglement with Malaysia is an intricate dance, born from mutual interests and a shared vision for prosperity. The depth of this relationship has been catalyzed by China's strategic investment across various sectors in Malaysia, marking it as more than just a series of business transactions. Instead, these ventures symbolize a deep-seated commitment to fostering diplomatic ties, bridging cultural divides, and envisioning a shared future. From acquiring stakes in iconic Malaysian companies to making significant strides in the realms of energy, infrastructure, technology, and culture, China has made it evident that their association with Malaysia is multifaceted. However, like any significant partnership, their relationship isn't devoid of challenges and complexities. Sovereignty, environmental concerns, and questions about transparency have often clouded their shared endeavors. Yet even amidst adversities, the commitment between the two nations has remained unwavering. To truly appreciate the nuances and magnitude of China and Malaysia's collaboration, it's essential to navigate through their shared journey from its motivations to its accomplishments and the inevitable complexities that arise. In understanding why China is buying stakes in Malaysian companies, one must delve deep into the heart of their relationship. China, perpetually in search of new markets and strategic alliances, perceives Malaysia as an ideal collaborator. This collaboration isn't merely transactional, it's a meticulously crafted strategy to promote economic growth, maximize untapped opportunities, and fortify China's stronghold in Southeast Asia. Simultaneously, Malaysia welcomes China's investments, viewing them as a pivotal fuel for its own burgeoning economy. The infusion of capital, access to advanced technology, and pathways to broader markets are the allure. With China, Malaysia has found a counterpart, ready and willing to journey together towards mutual prosperity. Yet beyond the economic tapestry lies a deeper layer of diplomatic nuance. These investments symbolize more than just financial figures. They embody a diplomatic gesture, forging powerful bonds, aligning mutual interests, and bridging any cultural or political gaps. By investing in Malaysia, China isn't merely making a business move. It is signaling its intent for a collective future built on trust and shared objectives. But like any partnership, this relationship isn't devoid of challenges. At times, it transforms into a beacon of hope, especially during adversities. A sationed example of this is the financial debacle surrounding Malaysia's 1MDB fund. Engulfed in controversies and facing financial turbulence, China's decision to invest and support affiliated projects was a testament to its commitment. This wasn't just about business. It was a testament to China standing firm with Malaysia, guiding and supporting during tumultuous periods, a true waltz in the face of adversity. In the intricate relationship between China and Malaysia, there are some pivotal investments that illuminate the depth and breadth of their relationship. In the world of automobiles, China's Geely took a significant step by purchasing major shares in Proton and Lotus. This move around 2017 was one of the most notable acquisitions in recent memory. Specifically, Sheshang Geely bought 49.9% of Proton, and as part of the deal, they also secured Proton's 51% ownership in Lotus, the renowned British sports car brand. Many speculated about the reasons behind Malaysia's iconic brand being sold to a Chinese company. However, it suggests that Proton, a domestic brand, was in need of assistance. Before the acquisition, Proton faced challenges in the Malaysian market, reporting a net loss of over 991 million Malaysian ringgit in March 2016. This prompted the Malaysian government to offer soft loans exceeding 1.5 billion ringgit. Geely's decision was not just about ownership, it indicated a vision for innovation and future expansion. A testament to this intricate relationship was just announced recently. Geely, through Malaysian Prime Minister Anwar, has announced that the Chinese company will invest over 10 billion US dollars to develop Malaysia's main automaking hub. China's ventures into Malaysia's energy and infrastructure sectors are equally noteworthy. 
Through strategic acquisitions of power assets and significant investments in infrastructure, China has woven a tapestry of development with Malaysia. A focal point of this narrative is the 1MDB assets. At a time when MDB desperately needed financial rescue, few were willing to intervene. However, China General Nuclear Power Corporation came forward, acquiring 1MDB's energy assets for a significant 3 billion US dollars. While this move had its share of controversies, it underscored China's growing footprint in Malaysia's asset ownership. In another major move, China Railway Group, a state-owned entity, reportedly secured a $1.6 billion stake in Bandar, Malaysia. Yet it's worth noting that by 2021, this project faced challenges and seemed to have lost momentum. The architectural landscape of Malaysia also speaks of this alliance. Chinese engagements in the Malaysian property sector, spanning both residential and commercial undertakings, are reshaping skylines and transforming communities. This mutual enterprise can be likened to a ballet, where each step meticulously crafts buildings and homes, adding harmony to urban and suburban landscapes. As the lens focuses further into this relationship, the domain of technology and innovation emerges as a cornerstone. Far from mere business engagements, the mutual endeavors in sectors such as information technology, biotechnology, and robotics indicate a shared vision of the future. For instance, Alliance Steel's 5 billion Malaysian ringgit investment in factory expansion isn't just an economic commitment. It reflects China's belief in Malaysia's technological prowess, and both nations drive toward mutual innovation. On top of Alliance Steel's investment, Jianlong Group's acquisition also earmarked a big breakthrough for the Malaysian steel industry. The Chinese company has acquired a stake in Malaysia's Eastern Steel Company, which, again, increases the influence of Chinese money in Malaysia. Beyond tangible assets, there is a confluence of culture and intellect. Chinese investments in Malaysian educational institutions, cultural hubs, and shared programs have birthed an invaluable exchange of ideas and values. This intermingling fosters mutual respect, understanding, and paints a picture of two nations converging not just economically, but also intellectually and culturally. Tourism, with its vibrant allure, offers yet another facet of this intricate relationship. Investments in hotels, resorts, and entertainment hubs are catalyzing a spirited engagement between the two countries. This flourishing sector is more than just economics. It's an embodiment of exploration, recreation, and cultural synergy. In the realm of agriculture, the relationship takes on a primal significance. With joint agricultural endeavors, collaborations in farming technologies, and investments in food processing, China and Malaysia are seeding a future of food security and sustainability. The essence here transcends mere business. It's about nurturing a bond that promises sustenance and prosperity for both nations. In any intricate relationship, there are bound to be moments of tension, and the partnership between China and Malaysia is no different. While the union ushers in waves of capital, technology, and newfound avenues, it simultaneously surfaces concerns around sovereignty, environmental impact, transparency, and accountability. These complexities inherent to any relationship between two powerful nations shape the dynamics of their partnership. Sovereignty issues often pose the question, where is the line between mutual benefit and over-reliance? Malaysia's increasing relationship with China generates concerns about losing its rhythm to a dominant partner, fostering discussions around the delicate equilibrium of control and collaboration. Moreover, with investments comes responsibilities. Industries like steel and energy bring about not just economic growth, but also environmental and social considerations. It's essential for both nations to ensure the relationship respects the environment and values community harmony. Questions about transparency, especially in the wake of collaborations linked to entities like 1MDB, emphasize the need for a dance grounded in trust clear intentions, and open conversations. The burgeoning interest of the Chinese middle class in Malaysian real estate has not been without its complexities. As aspirations of owning homes in Malaysia rise among the Chinese, concerns related to property rights, 
pricing disparities, and impacts on local communities emerge. It's a nuanced tango, with both nations seeking equilibrium between foreign aspirations and domestic priorities. Infrastructure investments, while showcasing the ambition of the partnership, also raise eyebrows regarding sustainability and local impact. The East Coast Rail Link, a monumental endeavor backed by China, serves as a testament to the balancing act required. Concerns about the project's long-term viability and its alignment with local interests suggest that, while the partnership's relationship is impressive, it requires continuous recalibration to resonate with shared goals. Political dimensions further complicate the relationship. Investments, though fundamentally economic, bear political weight, necessitating a tightrope walk of diplomacy and national interests. Debates surrounding Malaysia's 1MDB and China's offer of assistance is indicative of this delicate choreography, where decisions reverberate beyond monetary value, touching upon sovereignty and trust. And lastly, the relationship between these nations isn't just a two-step, it also involves Mother Nature. The environmental ramifications of expansive projects underscore the importance of a harmonious waltz that prioritizes sustainability. Whether in renewable energy ventures or urban developments, the partnership's rhythm should resonate with environmental prudence. The intricate tapestry woven between China and Malaysia serves as a testament to the profound influences nations can have on one another, both economically and diplomatically. Through a meticulous dance of investments, collaborations, and shared visions, they have showcased the potential of strategic alliances in driving growth, bridging divides, and forging powerful bonds. Yet, as the narrative unfolds, it's evident that such partnerships aren't without their share of complexities, from sovereignty debates to environmental and transparency concerns. Despite these challenges, the overarching story between China and Malaysia remains one of mutual respect, collaboration, and an unyielding commitment to shared objectives. Their collective journey serves as a compelling case study for internal relations, emphasizing the need for balance open dialogue, and adaptive choreography in the ever-evolving dance of diplomacy. But anyway, do let us know what you think. Thanks for watching.